Uh, now we are going to see about uh, Holly's appliance. It's a type of a removable fixed uh, removable appliance. And uh, after the completion of the fixed orthodontic treatment, in order to maintain the tooth position exactly where the where it is in the pr procedure, fixed orthodontic uh, treatment, we use this type of appliance. It's a removable type of uh, type of appliance. And um, in this Holly's appliance, it will maintain the tooth position exactly, and also uh, with help of the wire components. By using a stainless steel wire, the parts of the Harley's planes are a retentive component which is a clasp and an active component that is a labial bow. This labial bow it can be either short or long. Uh, uh, in this case, uh, I use this long labial bow. The long labial bow can be given if the tooth space is present uh, distal to the canine and in short labial bow can be used if the tooth space is present mesial to canine. And uh, in this case, I use a C clasp use a C clasp but uh, for, for good retentive purposes we have to use this Adams clasp we have to use this Adams clasp for, uh, but in this case I, do, uh, I use this C clasp because this long label is uh, extended till this uh, premolar and this retentive tags are given in which it will hold the uh, class position in its place and uh, it can be worn by the patient after the treatment of this fixed orthodontic procedure. Uh, now we are going to see about the fabrication of the removable appliance, it is Holly's appliance. First uh, I apply the sticky wax in which it will uh, hold, the, hold and stabilize this wire component in its place. First we have to apply the separating medium because it uh, helps in re easy retrieval of the denture from the model. We have to apply it. Then I have taken the polymer and monomer in syringe. I use the sprinkle on technique here. First, we have to put the polymer with the syringe. Then, a monomer is poured. Again, the polymer is poured on this surface. Like this we have to complete the full appliance. This is after the fabrication of the appliance. Uh, then I will remove the appliance and the trimming and polishing will be seen in the next video. Uh, this is after trimming of the appliance. The collar should not be sharp. Uh, then we will deliver it to the patient and ask the patient to keep it in this appliance in a container 